Travis Kelsey and Taylor Swift mm -hmm. set the internet on fire. And you know what? Their brands have never been bigger. Next up, Travis Kelsey. Oh. You've probably heard about this one. There's been a lot of buzz lately over whether the Chiefs tight end is currently dating Taylor Swift, partially due to his own brother helping fuel some of those headlines with his comments. The internet's going to break. The rumors apparently are true. Taylor Swift is friends with Travis Kelsey. That uh, Taylor Swift has finally put you on the map. <laughs> Shout out to Taylor for uh, for pulling up. That was pretty ballsy. That was pretty ballsy. Yeah, <laughs> I um, I just thought it was awesome how everybody in the suite had nothing but. I just think if you if you think too hard about it, and it takes you a long time to fall in love with someone. Joe Alwyn is about to embark on an emotional roller coaster, and who's responsible for this? None other than the queen of heartbreak anthems herself, Taylor Swift. But wait, there's a twist. Taylor Swift isn't just making headlines for her latest chart-topping hit. There are incredible perks that come with this life. There are also really heavy pressures that come with this life. She's also making waves in the world of sports. She's just gone public with none other than NFL superstar Travis Kelsey. Now it's safe to say that emotions are running high in Hollywood. Joe Alwyn's reaction to this sudden turn of events? Well, let's just say it's something you don't want to miss. Grab your popcorn because this story is about to get spicy. So without further ado, let's begin. In May 2016, Taylor Swift and Joe Alwyn met for the first time at the Fancy Met Gala event. People started talking about their meeting because one of Taylor's songs, Dress, hinted that they might have met that night, pointing to their hairstyles. No, I haven't. I've, I've seen versions way before, but I haven't seen the final cut, so I... Later on, someone who knows them well confirmed that they had been dating for a few months. They said it wasn't a big secret to their close friends and families, but they had kept it hidden from the media. Taylor had learned from her past experiences that it's better to keep her private life, well, private, jump to January 5th, 2020, a special day for them. They first appeared as a couple at the Golden Globes Awards. Taylor was nominated for a song she co-wrote for the movie Cat, and Joe was right there with her. They sat together and spent the whole night together, which caught the attention of people watching. So from the fancy Met Gala to the famous Golden Globes, Taylor Swift and Joe Alwyn have had an interesting love story. In a chat with Paul McCartney for Rolling Stone, Taylor Swift shared insights into how her relationship with Joe Alwyn influenced her music. She revealed their connection inspired her song, Peace, from the Folklore album. Taylor explained that the song reflects how her relationship with Joe made her think about privacy and dating, especially when dealing with her public image. She said that knowing Joe and having a relationship with him made her make choices that brought more real-life normalcy into her world, rather than just being a constant topic in the tabloid. Given the media's constant presence, Taylor wondered if it was enough to have some level of normalcy in their lives. Taylor also praised Paul McCartney for successfully balancing his public and private life, especially regarding love. She mentioned how challenging it can be to fall in love and meet someone who lives a more ordinary life when she, in contrast, is under the constant scrutiny of the media. We had Paul and John Lennon were on backup vocals with us in the in the 60s. And, uh... Moving to November 2020, Taylor confirmed a long-standing fan theory that Joe Alwyn was behind the pseudonym William Bowery, credited on some of her songs from the Folklore and Evermore album. She mentioned that Joe co-wrote Betty and Exile. Taylor revealed this during a conversation with the producers of Folklore on Disney+. Fast forward to December 2020 when engagement rumors started circulating after Taylor released a snippet of her re-recorded version of Love Story. Some fans thought the lyrics had changed to hint at an engagement. However, sources later clarified that the lyrics remained the same. In a conversation with Entertainment Weekly, Taylor referred to Joe as her boyfriend. Their relationship has been a mix of private moments and occasional public appearances, leaving fans Fans captivated by their love story. In April 2023, Taylor Swift and Joe Alwyn broke up after being together for six years. This surprised many people because there were rumors they might get married. The news about the breakup came while Taylor was on her concert tour in the USA. She looked sad while singing a song called Champagne Problems. People found out about the breakup from a source who said it wasn't a big fight or anything like that. They just realized that their relationship had naturally come to an end. 
Joe hadn't been seen at Taylor's recent shows, which was a sign things were changing. The breakup seems to be because Taylor didn't want to get married and settle down. Even though they had talked about it, she decided that wasn't what she wanted for her future. Ultimately, they decided to go their separate ways, but it wasn't because of a big fight or anything like that. They just felt it was the right time to move on. Well, Taylor Swift made a surprise appearance at a Kansas City Chiefs football game, fueling rumors about her dating NFL tight end Travis Kelsey. The dating rumors between Kelsey and Swift began in July, when Kelsey attended one of Swift's Eras Tour concerts in Kansas City. On the New Heights podcast, he later revealed that he tried to give Swift a friendship bracelet with his phone number, but was politely declined. Shout out to Taylor for uh, for pulling up. It was definitely a game I'll remember, that's for damn sure. Over the past month, whispers about Kelsey and Swift quietly dating had been circulating. Kelsey's brother, Jason Kelsey, was even asked twice in the past month to confirm their relationship status. Last week, Kelsey told ESPN that he had invited Swift to one of his football games and it seems the singer took him up on the offer. She was spotted at the game, where the Kansas City Chiefs faced off against the Chicago Bears at Arrowhead Stadium. During the game, Taylor Swift was spotted in Travis Kelsey's box, and she wasn't alone. She was seen hanging out with Kelsey's mother, Donna Kelsey, in a suite owned by Travis's younger brother. In videos shared on social media, they could be seen chatting, laughing, and cheering for the Chiefs together. Cameras even caught Travis Kelsey looking up at his box, likely aware of all the attention their joint appearance was getting. One fan at Arrowhead Stadium had a sign that said, Kelsey is swift to the end zone. It seemed like Taylor Swift appreciated the sign because she posed with it from a distance while a fellow spectator in the suite took a picture. You might not know Travis Kelsey if you're not into being winning two Super Bowls with the Chiefs, including the most recent one in February. Some Swift fans know much about football too, but mixing the two fan worlds and seeing their reactions is fun. Now let's quickly discuss why Kelsey is such a football star. He plays for the Chiefs and he's known for making cool touchdown plays, like the one Taylor Swift saw when the Chiefs beat the Chicago Bears. He plays a position called tight end. His job is to help protect the Chiefs quarterback, Patrick Mahomes, who's the guy that throws or hands off the ball. Kelsey is a big guy, so he's good at blocking the other team's players who try to tackle Mahomes. But what makes Kelsey really famous is that he's fantastic at catching the ball and running it to score a touchdown. He's broken many records for tight ends, like having the most seasons with over 1,000 receiving yards, the most seasons in a row with over 1,000 receiving yards, and having the most yards in a single season. So he's not just one of the best ever, he's also the first picture you'll see when you look up tight end on Wikipedia. In the world of famous couples, things can get pretty dramatic, just like in the movies. But like all stories, this one has an ending. Taylor Swift made her relationship official with NFL player Travis Kelsey, which was a big surprise. The world of fame, love, and privacy complicated things for Joe and Taylor. Taylor wanted to keep her personal life private despite being a famous singer. As we wrap up this story, we've seen how Joe reacted to everything, from being surprised to thinking about it all. It's a reminder that celebrities are just like us, dealing with the ups and downs of love and life. This story shows how hard it can be to keep your private life away from the public eye. And that brings us to the end of our discussion on Joe Alwyn's reaction to Taylor Swift making her relationship official with Travis Kelsey. We're eager to hear your thoughts about this surprising turn of events. Please share your thoughts and comments below. Your comments mean a lot to us.